Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be taking a look at a young lady from Paula Young by the name of Abby in the color Angel's Wing. So stay tuned. Hi everyone, welcome back. I'm Coco and this is Coco's Hair Solutions. By um, viewer request, I am doing Abby in the color Angel Swing. And here are her dimension or all of her information for ordering. And she's a short crop bop. She is available in all different kinds of colors. She's been around a tried and true workhorse for Paula Young. So we're just going to see what she is all about, okay? So I'll get her unwrapped and we'll try her on. Well, at least we'll look at her first, okay? Okay, so here she is. Nice, curly, short pixie. Curls all the way around. And we're going to go ahead and look at her cap construction first, alrighty? Well, look at this. She is, I believe she's part of the Whisper Light collection. And look at this open cap construction. The whole top, front, and crown is all open wefted. This is going to give you a lot more breathability. It's going to be very cool. And um, it's going to give you some a little bit of stretch up here, too. We've got a one-half inch velveteen band across the front hairline right here for comfort. We've got open ear tabs with, with all kinds of uh, fibers stitched on the underside so that they come out from underneath your cap and they look really natural. We have Velcro adjusters on the right and left of the nape. And then we have a, just a standard one half inch nape in the back. And then of course, open wefts everywhere else that give us all the stretch that we need. So before we put her on, let's look at this color. This is Angel's Wing. So it's got a little bit of brown black interspersed with it. It's not a pure white, but it's a softer white. So if you're looking for something that isn't quite so white and um, are hoping to find something, uh, you know, that's just softer, then the Angel's Wing might be the right color for you. Okay, so we got, we've got a brush. She doesn't have a lot of permatease which is really nice. For some people, we don't want a lot of uh, permatease, do we? Alrighty, so I'm gonna go ahead and put her on now. What I have on right now is Sammy. I, I did a review of her already, and you can find her amongst all my other videos, okay? Well, let's go ahead. Okay, this is Abby. She is curly enough to have a little bit of fullness and it looks like she would just about be a, a, a plop and go wouldn't she Let's see I've got I can feel the tag up here and so if it's poking out please excuse me but let's do a quick spin okay so this is her she has good sideburns coverage is fairly good this covers me on both sides fairly well. But of course I do have silver gray sideburns. So we've got lots of little curls everywhere, don't we? Okay, let's read about her dimensions, okay? So Abby, now of course Abby, it, this is the Whisper Light collection. She comes in um, a couple of um, more expensive versions. The first step up would um, be a monofilament front, and that's a deluxe Abbey. And nothing else has changed on her dimensions other than the fact that her cap has a mono uh, front. That's called the best. This is the better, it's whisper light. Then there's the best, which has the monofilament. Then there's the premium, which is 100% hand tied. So the whole cap is all stretchy mesh and it, it is hand tied. So you're not gonna have any wefts showing in that one. So let's take a look. She comes in this whisper light. She is 1.6 ounces. That is very, very light, unbelievably light. And of course, because she's whisper light, all of the fibers 
are very, very baby fine. They're a fraction of the width of normal Kaneklon or Kanek, Kaneklon. <laughs> Somebody's got to teach me what, how to say that word. <clears throat> anyway, the, it says the, the front is four inches. The top is four inches. The crown is three and one quarter inch. The sides are two and three quarter inches. And the upper back is two and three quarters inches. And then the nape is two and a quarter inch. She comes in 33 different colors. So that is amazing. She also comes in exclusive colors and renewed colors. So there is a huge, huge selection for this young lady. So, so for me to wear her, I have to make sure that I end up pulling these hair fibers forward and I can do whatever I want with the with the the bangs in it um, because of the curl they do hover around the front of the cap so they disguise the, the cap and I can uh, let's see we can part her on the side it looks like she wanted to come part it on this side let's see if we can part her on the other side now I know with water we'll be able to coax her to do something else but we can take our bangs sideways as well. She looks a lot like Casey in this regard, doesn't she? But I think she's got different dimensions, okay? And of course, I'm hoping that she's covering my nape really well. Let me pull that back so you can see how's the coverage on the nape. Is that pretty good? Okay. So this, oh, this is such a beautiful color, isn't it? This uh, angel's wing. Um, and of course, you know, she's just about full bulletproof, really. Now we can fluff her up with a little bit more volume on top. If you want, you can play her down. We can open up the bangs on either side. With the curl, I'll bet you, oh gosh, did your mom ever do this? Put those little curls like right there at the four temple. I bet you we could do that. Oh my goodness. <laughs> we could do that. Oh dear. Well, that's one look. Open it up on right in the center. Open it up off to the side. Open up the hairline a little bit. So you get a little bit more of an angle coming across. And we could do that in the opposite direction, couldn't we? Okay, now let's try. Let's try a little bit of water, okay? All kinds of dimension. Now, even though Angel's Wing is not a multi-dimensional color, she does have a blend of some, a little bit of brown black, a very, very tiny. So when we add water or we add um, a gel of some sort to our to wig with this color, we are going to experience seeing a change in the dimension of color. So, and I think with this, I want to kind of slick back the sides a little. I do want to keep my sideburns covering here. So you can wisp those forward and then take the sides and how's that look just bring them to the center in the back that looks nice feels nice too feels nice and of course I didn't do anything to the top did I <laughs> okay so we can leave her very full we can part her from one side to the next Okay, if you like a part in your hair. Okay, let me, I'm gonna also take a look at fixing her the way that she was in, in her picture too. We need to do that, see? Cause that's what you're looking at and that's what you're buying. That's kind of what you're expecting, isn't it? Okay, so in the picture, let's take a look at that together. She's pretty straight on the sides. And pretty straight, but kind of full on the top with just a little lift. Now this girl looks a little curlier. 
and maybe a little shorter than on the model. But that could be just how she fits on me. And so, but you've got the potential to have a smoother look or a curlier look. Okay, let's see, am I straightening out those fibers a little bit more? There we go. And maybe we just keep this all coming nice and smooth down instead of sweeping it back. Makes for a very nice, understated, polished look, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. And this is a great everyday pixie. And I can understand why she is available in so many colors and so many sizes. Well, let me see how many sizes. That'll be the tailor, tail, <laughs> telltale. <laughs> That'll tell us, let's see. Oh my goodness, she comes in mini petite, petite, average, and large. Okay, well that tells you right there, this is probably one of their most popular pixies. And in 33 colors plus all the extra colors, oh my gosh, every size in the universe. So for me, I probably would order a large if I was going to wear this um, for me because I would like a little bit more coverage to make sure that, you know, if, you know, just with the wear of the day, I don't want it slipping back away from my hairline. So, but this is Abby. It's the general Abby. She's on sale all the time for a very reasonable price point. Very reasonable. And oh my gosh, right now it's around the holidays and there are huge sales all the time. So you can pick her up for very, very little. And so if this is what you're looking for, she's a great workhorse. And you know, I have to say that even though the cap is white and this is a white, white wig, I do not think the whiffs are that visible. I, I, at least I don't see them up here, especially in the front. Now I could just see that there, okay? So you do wanna be mindful. If you watched a couple of my other videos, I talk about white wigs with white cats. And those are, are just, they're, they're prone to being able to be seen. So there are a few steps that you can take to help remedy that. One of them is coloring your cap darker, um, you know, or buying rooted wigs. But you know, those that means you sacrifice one thing for another. So you uh, think about that. And of course, when you order your wig, check and see or have someone check to see if they can see the wefts when you wear your wig. Alrighty. Well, this is Abby. This is the Abby Better. Abby better, <laughs> it's a whisper light. Then there's Abby Best and Abby Deluxe or Premium. So thank you so much for joining me here today. I hope you enjoyed this. This was a blast into one of Paula Young's tried and true workhorses. So I will, I'm so glad you joined me today and thanks so much for all of your support. And we will see you next time in Coco's Hair Solutions. Bye-bye.